All right, good Monday. It's awful here. Weather sucks. I was complaining about it on Friday. Guess what? Still here. And nothing makes me feel worse than awful weather and trying to guess this place in Russia. This is Russia. Now this is that's a Daewoo. This is Russia. Don't catch you slipping. No. Wait a minute. No, they're driving on the red side. It's funny when your brain is like 100% fine. Like every time you, you, you're answered this question any other time in your life, you're like, oh yeah, definitely. It's, it, they're going to be driving on the left side of the road they're, if they're not in a European colony. But just that one time, my brain just paused and said, wait a minute. This place sells gas and calipers in 15 kilometers. I didn't know Russia coveted calipers so much. But I'm in the middle of AC sessions right now because it would be very loud and or obnoxious for you to have to listen to me try to talk over this. So it's Roche Roshev. It's R O S N Rosneftsy Rose Rosnest Rosnest. Rosneftsy, I think. I don't know where Rosnefty is. I feel that this is agricultural land. Maybe here, but I don't fucking know. This is like you're in this you're in this town, province, whatever you want to call it, and then it's just this sign and nothing else really kind of exists as far as like a uh, localized cluster of buildings that most people would normally call a village and or town. Not denigrating you, Russia. You've kind of you, you build your cunt, the, your towns and whatnot the way you want. Your regions, your provinces. I'm sure there's some sort of logic behind it. <clears throat> Excuse me as I clear my throat, like DJ Cool told you to do, as one of the two most popular songs you'll hear in bars. And I'm just all over the place with these one-time anecdotes that I feel like I'm going to complain about. And this one, okay, so. Hear my logic on this. I've seen these type of designs. This is the dumbest logic. These type of designs on like trucks you see in like India, which makes me feel, well, we're not very close to said India. Maybe we're closer to the Asian part of, well, the Earls, I believe are this. They're like the technical dividing line between what is considered European Russia and Asian Russia. But, excuse me, I i don't know. My score is going to be terrible on this guess. This could even be Kazakhstan for all I know. This could be Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan. I do not know. It could be Tajikistan. It could be any Stan. Just not the song by Eminem that came out in, what, 1999, 2000? All right. One thing at a time here. Fuck, I'm just all over the place here. I don't even remember what I was complaining about before. I was complaining about the other thing I was complaining about before this thing I was complaining about. I think it first started out with memory being like 99.9% .9 okay. Okay. Taxis feel like they're closer to a urban location than they would be in the middle of nowhere but maybe this guy has a lot of money and i just thought it was weird that hey i'm not gonna remember this one piece of crucial information all right this is mal mal well i'm never gonna get a chance to read it well we were up here good for you i'll give it a three stars now i've like that pause has now caused me to not lose well to lose all semblance of thought trains and now i just like every single thing i was holding juggling in the air i just dropped like it wasn't that i lost constant well i did lose concentration but it wasn't like i was looking up at him my hands just stopped working i was tossing him in the air then i just saw something shiny and walked away from it and forgot i was juggling so now I'm just uh, walking down this dirt road. Not entirely sure where this is. Terracotta roofs. Could be a Mediterranean thing. 
these type of grain silos could be a central US thing. This is a dirt road with sunflowers that are dead past the season probably. Although this side has, oh, these are close to dying too. They're pretty sad looking when you see like spent sunflowers, like they're through their needing to blossom phase. Although this makes me feel like, is there a center of the world where it's like, yeah, we're number one sunflowers. Like I know, like I think, oh boy, this is gonna help, I think. Uh, this is just talking about a type of crane in the region. All right. This is Aragon, so this is probably the northeast section of Spain. I believe is where Aragon is. Isn't it? Let me let me let me blow this up a bit. I think like over here I'm going to click. I'm feeling that this is um actually it could be farther west. And this this goes right back into me not knowing exact locations for regions like I've played what's it, Europa Universalis or is this Castile? There's a sections of um Spain in the northeast here there's Castile, there's Aragon, which makes me feel like Aragon's actually over here more. And Castile is down here. And there's that big thing kind of going with like Castile wanting to get the fuck out of Spain and Spain leading like, yo, that's unconstitutional, you can't do that. Well there's Castellon, but that's not like I wish I I knew is this a province? Is this the province name? Like, I don't know. I've just put myself there to be okay with it, but hmm. There's no, like, visible town location anywhere here. I'm just gonna go this way. I feel like we've got a close enough area of Spain where, I, where, where I'm fine. But we'll see. Alright, let's get moving down here. Um... God, I was complaining about, I was like, man, I got a lot of stuff to say, and it's just, ooh, shiny, and just, now I've got nothing. I was just watching some of the summer games done quick. By the time this comes out, I believe it'll be over, because it ends on Saturday, so now you know exactly what time I was recording this. So, if the world ends between now and Saturday, I'm sorry I wasn't here for the hot topics to talk about it, even though I never really talk about hot topics. I thought about doing a little little blurb about uh Anthony Bourdain but I never did it kind of like everyone's like hey you know the, there's there's a certain stage when you get to be an adolescence where you're just kind of like latch on to somebody maybe it's your version of what the counterculture is and it, counterculture may be the backwards way of thinking of this where okay it was farther this way I still got I still got satisfactorily enough so I'll give it four stars Okay, it's another one of these where it's, uh, well, actually, that's a U.S. bill. So this is probably Germany or Italy. Or, uh, Germany or, um, Germany or fuck, uh, India. However, the U.S. dollar bill here, bill here on this weird-looking, um, kind of weird-angled. Where are we going? Um... I don't like this. Okay, they spelled Tokyo the non-American way. So we've got Bienvenue, French, probably Italian, English, German, other German, third German. This is like a choose your own adventure. So this is probably Germany, if it's between anything here. That guy right there has the prime desk because when you come into this room, see that guy can see that guy's computer. That guy can potentially turn around and see that guy's computer, but this guy got no one really looking at him. Maybe people outside, but if he wants to look at porn, he can get away with it faster than anybody else in the room can get. So I'm going to have to click on Germany for now and hope that I've gotten somewhere near... It's in a city of some sort. 
that's like typical thing you see in Germany as far as building style with the weird white with the brown wood. Well, this guy's got the even better view. Although, maybe move it to the, face the other way. So if they open the door, because I'm I'm just basing this all off. Okay, door opens. How I'm looking at porn. How quickly can I close the screen so they can't see it? This has the worst potential. If you just rotate it the other way, he would be able to react faster. I'm not even taking into consideration the fact that um, they're probably watching everything he's doing. Like, we're monitoring your internet use. Okay, we've got... I'd, I'd probably be able to identify sections. Kind of dirty there. Sections of Europe that... that this is with the way that the plugs are, but maybe this is more of a, like one of the universal European plugs that can do like six or seven countries. Um, I don't know. Y'all do weird plugs. This is a kind of tiny office, and it feels kind of like this optimistic startup, although I'm sure it's not. But they're kind of like, yeah, you're going to get all of this stylish monochrome, well, maybe like three color combination office furniture where we've got black, wood, stainless steel, gunmetal, if you will. And that's just what our, what we're going to be in. Okay, we've got art styles. I can't really, oh, okay, here we go. My Thompson hurts dicks for... Um, white green ideas. I don't know who quoted that. This isn't good drawing. I mean, it's better than I could do. Of course, these are kind of easy to do. I could draw the back of an elephant's ass. It's a weird looking bunny. And then this lion who's got hearts for her eyes. Another thing you could do too is like different regions of the world have their own way of doing cartoons like hand drawn stuff like you can okay I look at a bunch of french drawn comics and they kind of all follow the same suit granted I think Wakfu's kind of the exception to the rule when it comes to that stuff like you could look at Asterix or anything from that type well maybe that's more of a uh, a chronological thing than it is a ge geographical thing but I don't know you're watching the development of a hypothesis quickly dissolving into a wrong statement. Okay, this is hungry. Is it? The flag seem... Yeah, it's gotta be, because it's, it's vertical stripes. Okay. See, again, 99% of the time, brain would think this, and then I just automatically, like... Like, uh... Uh, freeze up. Okay, Budapest is hungry. That's right. It's, it's someone else at work was married to someone from another country, and they kept sitting here trying to say what um, capital they're from, and they thought it was Bulgaria, but Bulgaria does not have their capital. It's to be. Although Burgas is a Bulgarian uh, town, it's not a capital. And well, Budapest is two cities actually. Split in half by the Rhine? Oh, Danube. I get them, I get them mixed up. Where Buddha's on one side and Pest is on the other. But I hope I have the country right. Just off that flag alone. Or I'm going to have some egg on my face. I'm actually going to have some Burek on my face. Actually, I don't know if they do Burek here. I just assume they do. This is definitely the amalgamation region you've kind of got like your set like architecture and concepts when you think of like regions of europe i'll go back here see if i can explain this a little better i probably can't i mean i just very bad at explaining things where it feels like some of the architecture okay this is straight up like germanic and then you got other places that are kind of like no this 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 has a bit more Ooh, okay here we go 54 this has a bit more like Ottoman, because I do believe they got up this high. They they were 
I think, knocking on the door of Vienna, which was like the big scare at the time. So I gotta look for 54. Yeah, there's a couple of times when Western Europe got super scared of stuff. Uh, one was the Ottoman Empire. Because they, they, they came up pretty far up into here. And then the other thing, I believe, was the uh, Mongols. Well, there's 52, but that is not the number I'm looking for. 54, all right. Sukhods. Let's look for... Kesex Skemet. Okay, there's Kex Skemet and Sukhosti. So that's got to be up here somewhere. Well, going that way takes me this way. I need... So we're like here, I think. I'm just looking for that one. Oh, it's way down there. We're probably like in the center here then. We're splitting the difference. I'm going to say there. Feeling good. Confident. Thank you, Hungry. You did a good job. You did everything I ask of a of a geo guesser location. Just have your country's flag just pop up within the first 10 seconds. Helps me out immensely. I don't know if I would have been able to guess that, although I'm not really looking as hard as I normally would if I didn't have that big give get away. Actually, that probably has a URL on this banner here. Maybe. No, it wasn't that far off. We're, far, we're actually in... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> I'll get five stars. I don't care. I'm not going to pronounce that again. And here we are again with another uh, five stars again. I'm starting to really think that every time I hit five stars, it automatically puts you in the middle of some desert slash plain slash you don't know where you are. You don't know where you are. Okay. Why is there a dead end? Okay, there is a road there. I thought they just threw dead end in the middle of a field. It's like some sort of artsy statement. So this is potentially the US and or Canada. I'm not ready to assume either one yet. Maybe this house will have a flag in the front yard that'll tell me what I need. No, it's got nothing. The other side of the road, oh, we do have a mailbox for the whores. It looks like H-O-R-Z is their name. Um, there's a area code. This is a fancy ass house. This, this is kind of like a trend now you're going to see with a lot of, at least farmland that I'm near is, hey, we've got, they're slowly like chunking off sections of their farm and selling it as housing. And this is a, a kind of a silly stretch. They're like, okay, corn. And then like, okay, we'll do like a hundred yard wide by like a thousand yards back just rectangle build a house there okay and they do it make it look immaculate border it with these trees and then it's just corn nothing on either side they're just trying to inject suburbia into the middle of a cor uh, cornfield and i don't know how well it's working out for them but it's a thing now with like non commercial huge ass farms is that they're slowly if they feel like not, um, actually, that's probably say kilometers or my, well, yeah, this is the U.S. because that says speed limit 55. All right, so this is the U.S. Where in the U.S., I don't know. I got to pick a direction. I feel like there might be stuff here. Maybe this truck has uh, some some info on the side serving up Washington really again me not I think I had this happen to me one other time thinking I had somewhere in the Midwest and it turned out to be friggin the state of Washington huh and it turned out to be like this looks nothing like what I assumed Washington would look like Grant County. Can I find counties here? No, they don't do that here. I need to find a highway route sign here. 
Yeah, this never would have guessed that this is Washington. I mean, it's not a second. I'm almost feeling like I've been had. This this isn't Washington. And I'm just going to be like Washington County and just Washington County is this huge thing. And they just happen to only specifically serve central Washington. Like, I'm going to get a very bad score here. I'm just feeling it now. I haven't seen any other road signs anywhere here. I got to pick a route. I'm going to click you and just see what happens. I mean, you live in Washington. Good on you if you've seen this stuff. And this looks like what it should. This doesn't look like what this, this state should, should be here. They sell beer here. And that one says block 40 meets. Hey, I guess it is central Washington. Fuck me. I would have gotten a very bad score. Next to Gloyd. It just sounds like some sort of infection on your back. But, ooh. Good start to the week, though. 22-4. This might be one of the highest scores I've got. Maybe I got 24 once. I can't remember, but... That's going to do it for our Monday edition of some GeoGuessr, though. I'd like to thank you all for watching and apologize for the, like, 16 things I just blurted out for things I wanted to talk about in the beginning and just immediately forgot it but that's kind of what i do i mean i've been doing like 90 something of these at some point you think something would get better maybe it is and i'm just not noticing but whatever uh remember to like favorite comment subscribe tell your friends tell me anything you want to all tips are appreciated anything i talked about in this episode love to hear about it anything to help me get more of these consistent scores i'd love it but until next time, we'll be seeing you. Have a good one.